be too. Bye for now. Up next, all the latest national and international stories. And at nine, it's Outside Source with an interactive take on the world. Over the years, five institutions across Britain have created historical firsts and pioneered new methods of treatment from conception through childhood and on to adult care. These are their stories. How the NHS changed our world starts next Monday at 7 on BBC Two. How will Brexit affect young people? What will be the impact on their studies, job opportunities and travel plans? Brexit, nine months to go this Thursday on the BBC News Channel. This is BBC News. I'm Sean Lay. The headlines at eight. The Prime Minister warns that tax rises will be needed to pay for more funding for the NHS. So across the nation, taxpayers will have to contribute a bit more in a fair and balanced way to support the NHS we all use. Donald Trump says the United States will not be a migrant camp as he defends his policy separating families at the border. Government has lost a vote in the House of Lords tonight over its Brexit plans. Piers back to call to give Parliament a bigger say in the event of a no-deal departure from the European Union. And a new report says poor housing and insecure work mean the millennial generation will suffer ill health in later life. Hello, very good evening to you. Welcome to BBC News. Theresa May says tax rises will be needed to pay for an increase in the NHS budget in England. The Prime Minister has promised an extra £20 billion a year by 2023 for the health service, but she didn't...